Hi guys, uh, just wanted to sort of quick update. Um, I know a few people have sent me some very kind emails and asking me what's going on in my situation and whatnot. And um, uh, yeah, nothing's really changed. It's, um, it's kind of still keeping in the car and, and, and it is what it is. But um, um, I don't, I don't really know what to say. It's just nothing's changed. I've, I've got a couple of appointments with the local council next week to try and find some housing, um, but I'm not holding out too much hope for that. Um, and there's a also a hostel, which is like a like a homeless hostel, um, and I've got an appointment with them tomorrow. So, you know, maybe something will happen there. Um, but I uh, just wanted to say a quick thank you as well, uh, especially over the last eight weeks or so. Um, you know, I've had so much support and, and I can't thank you enough. And at, at the risk of found, sounding ungrateful, um, people have asked me for my PayPal account and this, that and the other again. And I'm not going to publish that again because it's really not going to make much difference to my situation. I've fortunately had a couple of old school friends um, that have helped me out and um, you know I'm, I'm eternally grateful to them because you know it, the shit did hit the fan and um, you know it, it kind of is what it is. I hate to keep using that phrase but um, yeah so so there are opportunities, there are, you know, avenues to go down. Um, but at the moment, um, you know, nothing's really changed. But thanks for the, you know, I've had so many kind emails and, you know, can't thank people enough for just being kind at the end of the day. <laughs> it's not about money anymore. It really isn't. It's just, it, it's become irrelevant. Um, it's just about whether I can, you know, find a kind of roof over my head. I think it's the most important thing. There's only so much living in your car you can do. So, um, um, yeah, at the, at the risk of sounding ungrateful, you know, I'd just like to say thanks to those people that did help me out. Um, you know, not only financially, because some people were very, very generous and very kind, and it did help me out. It, it helped me out a lot. Um, you know, but I suppose you know, money's just money's money's not limitless. You know, it's only limitless by the generosity of people that. <laughs> that can help you out, you know, and, and I've done it to other people, you know, so, you know, I know what it's like when other people are stuck and I've, you know, donated money or equipment and stuff like that and, you know, it's irrelevant, it's not about me and what I do or what you do, it's just, I just want to say thank you, basically. Um, but just a quick update, just to let you know, everything's fine. Um, and hopefully in the next few days we might, um, you know, resolve my um, issue with basically not having a, a roof over my head, thanks to Daddy Government that uh, wouldn't cover £1,600 worth of arrears. Divide £1,600 by 35 years of my working life and you'll come to the princely sum of £45 a year. So for the sake of £45 a year, the government said, no, they're not going to cover my £1,600 arrears. Um, and this is the situation I find myself in. But uh, that's because everyone thinks the government's there to look after them. They're not. The government does give a flying fucking monkey's bollock about you. And I'm proof positive of that. So anyway, I'm not going to go on. Uh, again, just like to say thanks to everyone for helping me out, and you know you're so kind. And even those people that I had so many messages and comments and whatever saying sorry can't help you out financially, but just wish you all the best and stuff like that. And 
and even that was just great it was just it was so uplifting it was it was really nice to hear you know some really genuine people and genuine comments and and even those even those are just you know simply you know just gives you a bit of faith in humanity to a certain degree and it's not about money it you know yes don't get me wrong you know the donations did really help my situation at that particular time um but also just as much it was just just the nice comments and and people saying that i'm sorry i can't help you out financially but you know people sent me links to you know um you know homeless hostels and and things like that and just little links to jobs and things that might you know help me out and you know it was those it was those simple things i think that that, that were that, that were really touching as well because even just simple messages and comments just saying look keep your chin up you know keep going don't worry we got your back and stuff like that you know they were really really super kind so thank you to everyone that's helped me um and just don't worry about it it's fine everything's fine um i'd like to come back and do some more videos um in the near future but at the moment i'm i'm really struggling for battery power and um and um i've only got the power bank left so i can't keep running the car's battery down um so fortunately a friend of mine came down and, and jump started my car and we managed to get it to Halfords where they finally admitted that their battery is fucked, which is it was fucked. I could have told them that straight off the bat. Um, so they actually replaced the battery and given me a new battery for the car. So at, at least I can sort of move the vehicle and, and uh, you know, while it's running, I'm charging stuff. So it, it, it's not too big an issue. Um, but yeah, sorry, I'm rambling on. I have a habit of rambling, don't I? <laughs> anyway, uh, less about me and more about you. Thank you. Thank you so much for all your help. And, um, you know, um, I'll just keep plodding on, you know. It's, it's kind of all I, it's all I can do. Um, I'd love to get back to auditing. Do you know what I mean? It's just just one of my passions is to get back to doing that. Um, so anyway, um, I'm limited of scope and battery power and everything else, so I, I, I am really limited. But hopefully we'll find out tomorrow over the next four or five days, we'll find out if at least I can get into somewhere where I can get a bed for the night and... Um, you know, charge my equipment and um, and sort some work out and stuff like that and uh, go from there. So just want to say hi and thank you and um, I really appreciate all your support. Okay. Thanks, guys. Really do appreciate it and I'll speak to you all soon. And take care. But, you know, don't worry. Everything, everything's fine. I'm just trying to figure everything out because... I've never been in this situation before, so I have to kind of, you know, just go by whatever the council and this, that and the other says I have to do and blah, 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 and, you know, walk the walk as it were. So, anyway, thanks very much for your help. I'll speak to you all soon. Take care. Thank you very much as well for all your time, your comments. Can't thank you enough. All right, take care, guys. Look after yourselves. All the best. I'll speak to you soon.